Welcome back to my channel, guys. It's your girl, Coco Styles. And on this channel, we talk about beauty, fashion, lifestyle, and style. So today I have a couple of things in from Kaz, something in from Zara, and I want to say, oh, a brand called Iro. And I'm doing this video because I want women to know that tall girls can actually shop at regular brands too, to do a little bit more footwork when it comes to shopping. Now, with that being said, I am six feet tall. I weigh about mm, <laughs> probably about two, two ten, but I'm slim. That is probably what helps me fit into a lot of these clothes. And also, I know my measurements, like the back of my hand. I read details. I know what brands to shop, what brands not to shop. Um, and it's the same thing for shoes. So I'll link everything below for you guys. The Zara item, I'm going to link it as well, even if I don't keep it, because it's really, really great quality. And I'll show you that when I get to that. But let's get into the first item that I bought from Iro. Here's the first item from a brand called Iro. And it's kind of like a, I don't even want to say it's a wool blend. But let me show you guys how I would style this. And let me know what you guys think. So I got the first item on, which is the vest from Iro. I'm going to pop in a little video with me wearing it. This is a really nice vest. I don't even know what the material is. It feels kind of not wool. I don't know. I can't I can't think of the name. Um, let me come a little closer. It's a really nice vest. I got it from the outnet and I got it on sale. So you guys know how I feel about sale shopping. I'm not really a sale shopper unless it's like one or two things. It's an essential piece um, that I know that I'm going to wear. Um, and the other thing is if it's something that I already had on my wish list. The other thing that potentially can be a part of that is if it's something in my wish list that's so expensive, but I found a very similar item, i.e. this just best, then I would say get it. I do not like sell shopping because people tend to buy things that we just don't wear. We just buy it because it's on sale. And we tend to buy things that literally do not fit our wardrobe aesthetic or our personal style. So that's my reason. But the jacket, well, the vest, is really nice. Let me step back just a little bit more so you guys can see it. And then I guess I'll pop in a, a video or something. But it's nice. It has some buttons. How many buttons? Three buttons across the bottom. I got a size medium and I'm six feet tall. If I would have gotten a large. It probably would have been super big at the bottom. Um, I'm slimmer now, so I really have to be careful on things that I do buy. And I love it. I'll link it for you guys. It's still not cheap, but it's definitely not as expensive as that other one that I saw. <laughs> but let me get the next item on. I think the next item I'm going to show you is the stuff from Cos. Let me just get the dress and show you guys. Because I'll do the Zara piece last. It's literally like a uh, a sweater. So the dress from Cos is really nice. Can you guys see that? Now, I got a 12. It may actually be a little bit too big on me, on my waist area. But I could always get that taken in if I wanted to. Um, but it's a nice, flowy, like, utility dress. It has pockets. Very cute. It's a little wrinkle, but I'm going to show y'all. Um, and this was 135 And let me see. Cost has, let me see. I don't think it has the... And it's made in Turkey. I don't know if I said this to you guys, but Zara is the same way. When you're buying things from Zara and they're made in Turkey, I want to say it's Turkey. They have, like, the stuff made in Turkey is, like, the quality is just, like, a little bit step up from the other stuff. So keep that in mind when you shop on these high street brands. Um, but, yeah, I'll try this on let you guys see how this one it's my frame. All right, so here's the dress. I'm going to pop in a video, but I'm going to see if I can step back and see if you guys can see it. Probably not. <laughs> but the dress is cute. I have them on my boots again. They're sliding down because I have on lotion. So that's going to drive me insane. But really nice dress. I did get a size 12. And the reason why I got a size 12, because it's a little bit big on the side, was solely because I needed it to fit over my shoulders. You guys know sometimes when you buy things, the shoulders just don't fit properly. But it's a really nice dress. I'll show you guys the video. It's really nice. 
maybe I'll take it in, but it has some pockets here on the sides. Um, I may take it in like two inches on each side, but if I don't, it'll be fine because I could always wear it with like a, a leather jacket and kind of have like a cute little effect. And maybe I'll try that on and show you guys that as well, but really nice. Let me come a little closer. It's just a khaki utility style dress from Cos. And this was 130, 135, <laughs> which I thought was pretty good because the quality is really, really good. But that's the second item from Cos. All right, and then I'm gonna get on, actually the last item for Cos, I may put it on last. And then just show you guys the Zara, the Zara sweater first. So the sweater from Zara is cute. I'm not even gonna pop in a photo, but I am gonna show you guys it up close. This is a really thick sweater. I don't know if it's gonna zoom in. Can you guys see that? It's really thick. Like, this is a really nice sweater. My sister said it was, I'm showing my age <laughs> by buying a sweater like this, but I think it's nice. With a cute pair of jeans, I just have on some jeans with it. Yeah. It's like rich, it's given Chanel without being Chanel, you know? Really cute. I think it's cute. This is an extra large, um, and I think it fits good for a chill day. Like today, if I wanted to just wear this outside, some jeans and a top cute bag the weather is so up and down here so it might not even be <laughs> super cold for a sweater but a nice nice sweater the buttons are gold i like them because they're not like a plain shiny it has like a little bit of detail on it but a really really nice sweater i forgot to show you guys this sweater this is from Cos as well it's the same like the gray one that I bought last week. It just came back in black and this is the one that I originally wanted. Really nice wool sweater, wool. Okay, girls. Um, I probably don't have to try it on, but I, I will to show you guys how I would style it. Um, just a black cardigan, really. Um, and then the last piece that I got from Cos is this sweatsuit. Now hear me out. I'm not a sweatsuit girl. However, the color of this was like right up my alley. So I figured that I could wear this with some shoes or something. I'll show you guys when I put it on. But I think it's really cute. It's a little wrinkle. But I may wear this outside today. Yeah, super cute. Yo, very quick. You know, in my closet, um, I'll put the sweater on now so you guys can see. Listen, Cos may be boring with some things, um, but they do have really great wool sweaters. They have really great cashmere sweaters. So it really just depends on your budget. Um, when it comes to buying a cashmere sweater, you can find some for super cheap and you can find some really, really expensive. It really just depends on your budget. budget. But they have great, great sweaters. Great knitwear. I absolutely love it. Um, their knitwear is good. Their t-shirts are good. They have good quality leather like pieces and accessories. Their boots and shoes. Um, what else? They have a men's section as well. So if I have any men that's following me, definitely give them a try. If I was a guy, I would shop there. Great quality. You don't have to keep buying your stuff over and over. Get a bang for your buck, girls, girls and guys. So let me get on the sweater and show you guys how I will actually style a black cardigan sweater. So here's the sweater. I'm going to pop in a video. My ottoman is in the way, but you guys remember this skirt from um, Noma Kamali? Yeah, I'll show a full video or a picture or something because the skirt is like massively long. But this is a really, really nice sweater and skirt. So, like I said, Cos has 100% wool stuff. So that means I can have this for a really long time. Take care of it. It was 135. I think it's great for a wool sweater. Um, and I love it. Yeah, I got a size medium. The skirt doesn't have pockets, but the sweater does. Thank goodness. You guys know pockets are like essential for any fancy schmancy outfit. But yeah, let me know what you guys think in the, oh, and my glasses are 
these are the new glasses that I bought. They're like yellowish tint, but they actually really match the skirt now that I have it on. But yeah, sweater is nice. Great quality. Just a basic cardigan that we all need in our closet. <laughs> and this one just so happens to be wool and really, really nice. Let me back up a little bit again so you guys can see. Sweater has pockets, but the skirt does not. And the skirt is super long. Yeah, my camera may be a little bit high today, but you guys see. All right, let me get on the last outfit and then we should be done. All right, guys. I'm gonna pop in a photo or a video so you guys can see it. It's just that my ottoman's in the way and I can't really show y'all. <laughs> so I'll pop in a video so you guys can see it. Now for me, I've never been a girl who liked hoodies. It's just kind of like makes me feel like a kid a bit. But when I got to Kaz, I thought this was a really, really, really nice color. And the pants are barrel style and they're not meant for someone who's tall, but I had an idea when I was in the store trying them on. I'm just gonna back up just a bit. And I have on a pair, I don't know if you guys can see that, a pair of like nude uh, boots. Pants are barrel style. And um, they're actually not meant for someone who's tall, but the way they were fitting in the store, I thought it was really cute. So I was like, let me just get them and then kind of play around with it when I get home. And I love it. The sweater is a large, the pants is a medium. And I thought it came out really cute. Eliza Johnson specs. Very chill, simple, simple outfit. <laughs> but you girls could definitely dress up sweatpants or a sweatsuit in your own way. Right, let me know what you guys think about wearing a sweatsuit with shoes. Would you do it? Is it a no for you depending on the style? What do you feel about this look? I think it looks really good on me on my frame. Um, it may not be for everyone. And that's the other thing. You want to get, you want to wear things that work well with your personal style and your wardrobe. So with that being said, thank you guys for tuning into this video. I hope you guys enjoy all the pieces that I've shown you today. Cost is a really good place to shop. The outlet is another good place. Zara is like hit or miss. I've said this before. That sweater just so happens to be really nice quality. Um, but thank you guys for tuning in. Make sure you are subscribing to the channel. If you want more videos like this, comment below. And if you stay to the end of this video, please comment Coco We See You. And guys, don't forget to follow me on Instagram at Coco Styles NYC and Coco Styles NY. And my personal style blog, Coco Styles NYC. And my style services, Coco Styles NY. And I'm on tickety, tickety, talk, Coco Styles NYC. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.